All right, what's up, YouTube? So, a uh, new video today. Um, this is going to be a self-portrait day. Got this super cool mirror you can see right here. I'm really excited for this one. Um, I don't really have, like, a concrete idea, but I'm just going to play around with the shots, with the camera, see what I can get. I'm going to use the Promis filter today, and uh, I want to, like, make this, like, a really cinematic look. So, we're going to see how that turns out and see what I can get. And I will take you guys along for the whole video. So the shots that I'm going through in my mind and then the editing process as well. So just stick along for the video and be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Okay, so right now I'm thinking about doing a Photoshop edit, like putting myself in the mirror and then myself like on the outside, reaching back into it. Um, I just took a couple like from over here looking like that way. And now I'm gonna move the tripod and try to get a different angle, see what I can get so that I can make this look as good as possible. Uh, hopefully it comes out well. And like I'm getting some other cool shots too, so it's not just gonna be based on this Photoshop edit, but that's gonna be a big part. All right guys, I am back in my room. I'm gonna edit the photos on my computer. Um, it turned out really well actually, um, photographing and then finding different angles to capture stuff. So I've got a lot of stuff. Some stuff I didn't show you when I was out there, but um, I'll show you now. And I hope you like the video. Uh, don't forget to like and comment on the video. Like as I'm going through the photos, maybe comment what your favorite image is. And um, I'm gonna just take you along through the editing process, um, maybe like some of the Photoshop stuff. Um, but yeah, just stay along for the video and I hope you enjoy it. So as you can see right here, um, for this one, since I want it to be like a cinematic style, I wanted to just start off with one of the Lightroom presets that's available. So I just did that and I'm editing just through there. So I'm just gonna go in and like change a couple things and then get it to like where I like it and um, what I wanted to like get out of this picture because I wanted to use the Pro Mist to give it that like kind of filmy vibe and um it's that's what it's doing right now as you can see like with these highlights over here like you see that glow like right there and then in here as well and that's like what i wanted from this so i'm gonna like keep using this and then i'm um, just making little tweaks here and there for um specific things that i i want in the photos Okay, so I opened up three photos in Lightroom. I've got a blank background uh, with just the mirror and then one background with me sitting over here on this um, bench and then another background uh, with this umbrella cover like that. Okay, so um, I'm going to put this background over this one so that it looks like this umbrella is coming right there and covering some of the mirror. So what we're gonna do is go to this background here and I've already made copies. So you just hit Command J to make an another layer of the image. And then I'm gonna hit uh, Command C, copy it, and then Command V and paste it on the background layer. And then one more time to this one, I'm just gonna copy the top layer and then paste it over here. Okay, and now I'm just gonna move this layer here. Let me show you that layer of me sitting on the bench up to the top. And now I'm going to put a layer mask on it. And I've already got my brush tool on and you wanna set it to black. So you're painting over it and watch what this is gonna do. It's kind of like you're erasing it like the top of the image, but you're not actually doing that. Uh, with the layer mask, you're not creating destructive edits, so you can always like go back and delete that. So it's just um, a nice, easy tool to use when doing something like this. Um, so we've got the umbrella in there. Okay, and now we're gonna get my arm. Pretty 
pretty basic edit, but um, it's like a cool look and um, something super easy to do that can spice up your photos a little bit if you like doing things like that. Um, but now we're done. And see, that was it. We'll do another one for you guys, just so maybe you can get the technique down. It might be easier to follow. So you have two examples. So again, I've got my layer copies. So I'm gonna command C and then put it on the background. And then do the same with this. Make a layer, command J, and then copy that with command C. Put it right there on the background. Okay. So for this one, I'm gonna have like me sitting right here. I'm gonna erase this area in here. And then I'm going to like have myself in the mirror pointing back at myself outside the mirror, if that makes sense. Um, so yeah, just watch along. It's gonna be the same um, concept. This time we're gonna have a layer mask on both of them though. So we'll start off, um, we'll put this one on top actually. So we'll start off here and gonna make a layer mask. Let me just move this real quick. There we go. Okay, we got the black. So we're gonna get rid of this hand and then right in here, in here zoom in a bit oh, we'll fix that part up there too make this a little smaller there we go make it a little smaller oops that's it again and we're just erasing that in there just another simple edit but um, as you can see it just brings more creativity into you, your photos and it's really easy to do so um, I hope you guys try this out I'd love to see it if you show me pictures in the comments stuff like that I'd love to see it